point and come through. from start to finish. We might not physically be a beast and manifest ourselves into a prince, but we definitely go through different stages of life. And I think that narrative has transcended for generations. It's why it started as a French novel. It's why it became a Disney movie. It's why we've seen the Broadway musical, many remakes. We all change over a life. I think it really has been a tale as old as time. There's something new and something fun about every single piece we get to create, whether it's custom beading and embroidery for the sleeve detail on some of these costumes, or something that's been very fun for me is actually getting to pattern a lot of these and getting to drape like the bodices for Belle's looks and things like that. There is always something fun, always something new, always something exciting to get to do for every single one of these pieces. I think as a part of theater, how someone looks is so important and also how you feel as an actor in your costume and that helps complete your character. I am Alison Hearn. I am the costume shop manager here at Studio 10. I'm also the hair and makeup designer for Studio 10's production of Disney's Beauty and the Beast. I think color is really important. Doing a lot of fun colors in the enchanted objects and having them be not human when we first see them and doing like things in the makeup that, that make them a little shimmery and a little sparkly and, and feel enchanted and, and elevated. And then when they're humans, seeing what that person is like. Just really digging into the people and their personalities and how they would present themselves when they finally get to be humans again. One of the core themes for Disney's Beauty and the Beast is the magic that happens. It's the idea that in our everyday reality, something magical could happen. As we continue to talk about the magic of this production, um, it's important for me that families, children, adults can walk away and be inspired to go out and try something artistically. And for that, two and a half hours in your day or in your evening, there's a fantasy that you get to be a part of. What attracted me about theater was truly the magic and the wonder of it. And to be able to create that magic from the other side, to have those younger kids come in and see something that they are blown away by is why I do this. Theater is all about storytelling and taking people to a whole other place. I'm so lucky that the scenic department 
is a big part of that. We're creating a whole nother place. Being able to impact this story, to impact people, is a huge privilege. And I'm so thankful that me and my team get to be a part of it. It's Beauty and the Beast. It's magical, it's fun, it's a classic. It's probably one of my first theater memories and, and movie memories that, that made me kind of believe in magic. I'm excited for families to come see this. The thing that I find most exciting about theater is when multiple generations can come and watch a story together and all relate to it and talk about it and sing the songs on the way home. And I think this is a, a perfect choice for Studio 10 and a perfect choice for people to come see it during the holidays.